Well, hello everyone, and welcome to this week's travel update. I have to say you have been keeping us very busy this week. I am delighted to announce it has been the busiest week for new bookings that we have had since the pandemic started some, well, I couldn't even tell you how long ago, almost two years now. We have an exceptionally busy week. What have you been booking? Well, you've been booking holidays for pretty imminent departures, traveling for this winter. Places like the Canaries are very, very popular as is Egypt, so people looking to get some some winter sunshine, and also bookings for this summer. A lot of families booking to get away over the summer, particularly for the kids' holidays in July and August. So that's the kind of trends that we're seeing at the moment. A couple of other points. We are going to be open this Sunday in Taunton and Yeovil, 10 through until 4, but equally our phone lines, and this is really important, our phone lines are open seven days a week until 10 p.m. at night. So if you want to get a hold of us, it will be easy any time up until 10 at night. So good news there. Final things to say, there will, we hope, be an announcement next week. That is the talk, and certainly Boris Johnson muted it in the House of Commons two days ago, that there will be an announcement on travel very, very soon about a lifting, in finally lifting, of the day two test when you come back into the UK, the lateral flow test. Now that will mean finally, I hope I will be able to say next week, that you can travel on your holiday with zero testing to go out and to go back to numerous destinations around the world. So finally we are getting to a little bit more normality and I think we can definitely say that travel is back on for 2022. Look forward to catching up with you next week. Thanks very much.